Greetings, beloveds. Tonight, we are going to discuss the allegory of the Adam and Eve story. Eve was supposedly tempted by a serpent as she encouraged Adam to take an apple, which caused the fall from grace for humanity. But guess what? Everything happens for a reason, and this exactly is what was meant to occur for a godlike being to have the human experience. In actuality, Adam is really atom, which is energy turned into matter to create cells, morphing into tissues, organs, and other matter to create the human body. Good evening. Anything dealing with Eve represents nighttime or darkness, those things which are hidden and mysterious. In actuality, Eve would be synonymous to darkness, the mysteriousness of the subconscious and the melanin cosmos ether of the omniverse. And that old pesky snake whom we all have feared represents the DNA helix and also the kundalini energy that you have tapped into in your spine within your ancestral memory bank. The 23 chromosomes from both your mother and then your father is what completes you to have a human body and human experience. The fall of a godling into humanity. Once upon a time in English culture, the F-U-C-K word that we often use for sex meant fornication under the consent of the king because the subjects had to get permission to procreate and have a child in those days. So that is where the word F-U-C-K comes from. So when they were speaking of Adam and Eve having the knowledge of good and evil, there is an urban saying that F-U-C-K related to sex represents for unlawful carnal knowledge. So it was the procreating of Adam and Eve which created the human experience and the so-called fall of mankind from godlinghood to humanity to go through the human experience to rise back to its God self. Good night.